Ha! Hey, what's up, everybody? Prosmo22 here, bring you another video. And today we're going to be we're going to be adding on to the Transformers lore correction series. I need to stop with that weird head movement. I don't know what that was. But the Transformers lore correction series is well, nobody is perfect. I'm mean, gonna try to be, but um, you know, little mistakes pop up here and there, especially when you're doing something more of an academic nature, like Transformers lore academic. That's a that's a word I probably shouldn't be using for Transformers. But it's important to be a credible historian by, you know, pointing out whenever you make a little mistake here and there. And, you know, elaborating on them, fixing them, what have you. So we do have some minor things to talk about here. In Transformers Lore 101 Episode 1, someone pointed out that Micronauts and G.I. Joe were 3 and 3 fourths inches and not 8 inches, like I said in the video, and that is true. Now in the Ark Crash video, even though that wasn't really an actual, like, video really you really need to do any research for that was a th i don't want to say theory i hate the word theory i i at least hate using the word theory in the sense of you know what i mean but one person so this isn't necessarily a correction but one person brought up a good point about the aerial bots going back in time and creating well having a role in creating optimus prime and that was something that i completely forgot about so there was a point there. However, there are a lot of people who made po like made theories that just didn't work with the canon. And then there was this dude who was just so angrily wrong. I mean, I don't really know how to describe it. He was very sassy and very confident in how wrong he was with his comment, which is interesting. Artifacts of the Thirteen. Now, this isn't necessarily a correction. Um, just a little note that I had people some had some people asking about, and I felt it was worth addressing. I didn't talk much about the Matrix of Leadership there because, you know, the Matrix of Leadership really can be its own video. And there are a lot of details and nuances involving the Matrix of Leadership, whether it is or is not an artifact of the 13. There are specific versions that are, but not all of them. By the way, a lot of comments in there suggesting, what about the Cyber Keys, what about yada yada? Those aren't artifacts of the 13. Did they come from the 13 or did they come from Primus? Ask yourself that before you, before you make a comment. In fact, this is just a full warning to anyone who watches my videos. If anyone states something as a fact in my comments, uh, I think it's about 75% of the time they're just wrong. <laughs> I'm not going to bother to correct every comment. Why, why would I even bother trying to do that? So take what you hear in the comment section well, with a grain of salt, really. People have been trying to say that they got the first Transformers comics from 1983. You might want to rethink that date there, buddy. On Cybertronian languages, someone pointed out that I forgot the Minicon languages. And <laughs> by forget, that's absolutely true because I completely forgot about the Minicon languages. And there is a lot with the Minicon languages that I do want to cover. So do expect that to be its own video, sort of an addendum to the Cybertronian language videos. That's something important that I really shouldn't have forgotten. But that video will be coming at some point. In the Infiltrating Cobra episode, I mentioned that uh, Chuckles left Max to his death when they were destroying that Cobra facility. And that's not true. Uh, Max survives and he's gonna show up later. Um, and then he's gonna die, but you know. So that's all I have for Transformers Lore Corrections episode two for today. You know, short video, it's a corrections video. Uh, it, it's been a long time since the last correction episode. But you know, uh, if I had a big thing to be corrected that would have been taken care of earlier on, but I had nothing big that I messed up on. That hasn't been brought up in like the first corrections episode so you know let them build up over time a bunch of minor things so i can have a video so thank you so much for watching this um addendum this um appendix this uh these authors notes or what have you uh some little corrections little footnotes here and there to you know fix up touch up and uh, build up the transformers lore series you might have noticed that there wasn't a last m video for the movie week stuff and that's because i watched last night and the script didn't make sense anymore. It was about everything we know about the Knights. And it took everything we knew about the Knights. The only thing is, last night sort of just threw away everything we knew about the Knights in the first place. So, it, uh, what? But I digress. That can be a subject for its own video. This is just an update, you know. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe if you want. Follow me on social media for updates. Join the subreddit for further discussion where I can respond to corrections or attempted corrections much more easier and faster than it just in YouTube comments. Um, and yeah, have a good day, ladies and gentlemen.